Hello, my name is Robert. I'm with All In Moving Systems, and today we're going to show you how to do basic packing with the uh, common household uh, kitchen items. So we're going to today we're going to start with glass and plates and bowls. Um, this is a procedure we like to also show our movers. Uh, so in the same way, you can get the same advice and the same technique we like to show our guys when they go into the field. Today, we're going to start with these few plates here. We're going to show you how to pack them properly with our packing paper as well as to how to load it inside of the box that you're loading. Always make sure you have a nice flat surface area to work on. That way you have plenty of space to separate the items and the glassware that you have, and you have a big open space to start packing. When starting off with, I always like to start with larger plates. Um, usually you like to start with a small box, sometimes a medium. Depends on how heavy and big the plates are. You want to start with one layer. I always like to use two sheets here. It's a little bit safer, the glass is thick and heavy. And you usually like to have this gap in between, that way that nothing gets scratched or damaged along the way. So after you make that first two layers here, you want to stack it up here and make another layer with the paper you already have. Now, with the packing paper, you want to make sure to utilize the packing paper the right way and not using just one sheet per plate, you'll run out of packing paper before you can finish with what, everything else you have to do. So when we start here, we made our new layer. You always want to have plates of the same size. Um, when the plate's smaller and you try to wrap with the larger plate, it usually has room to slide around. So you want to make sure that everything is the same size with what you're packing. So after we make our second layer, we'd like to do one more, just with the paper that you have, um, to make sure that we get as much packing as we've done with the two sheets that we started with. You have to use your final piece here, like you cover it up. Even though that we covered it up, there's still a little bit exposed. So I like to use one final sheet of paper just to make sure that all the glass is covered. So after it's closed up, there's no plate exposed whatsoever. Now when putting, this is the most important part. When you put it inside the box, we need to make sure that it's upright and not laying flat. The reason why it's not enough, um, I'm going to say it's not enough um, uh, protection when it's laying flat, it's more prone to getting broken. So we want to stand it upright, just like this in the box. Now before I start loading the boxes, you have to make sure that we have enough padding on the bottom. Usually with small boxes, I use two to three sheets of packing paper. Uh, as the box size gets bigger, we use more packing paper for the bottom. So. You want to take a couple sheets here, make sure to bunch them up. You want to be conservative, so just use what you need. Like two to three sheets inside of the bottom of the box is usually plenty enough. Now again, when you're setting the box up on your packing surface area, you need to make sure you have enough room to uh, put your box down. That way you're not bending down and hurting your back. You want to make sure that you have a nice area too, so where it's comfortable when you pack. Like so, you always want to start on the corner of your box that you have, and you work your way over, so you make a nice fitted box when you're all done. Now, same thing with the smaller plates. Same plate, smaller size. You want to make sure two sheets again, layer, another layer, and your final layer. For the smaller plates, you don't need to use two extra sheets. Two is enough. It'll cover all areas of the plate. And again, you put it inside the box, you want to make sure that you put it and separate it from the larger plates to make room for the more uniform here. And after this, we're going to show you how to pack dish, dish, dishware and mugs and glasses.